What's good YouTube? This is Alex slash Kerrigan Beats and today I bring you guys a very exciting uh, and very much needed update video uh, along with an unboxing. I recently just purchased this uh, Rogue or Asus Rogue or Rog or whatever you know, however you pronounce it. I'm not really sure what the model number is. Uh, I can't look at the uh, my purchase on Amazon because I'm using my phone to record but uh, I will have um, what I purchased in the description, uh, you'll be able to look at it, see all the specs, how much it costs. Uh, I believe this was on sale, and it was like 5% off or something like that. I think it was about a thousand, almost a thousand one hundred after uh, tax and everything. But yeah, you know, it was a, it was a good purchase, and uh, I can't wait to use this. Uh, the reason why I got this new computer because I needed something more to help me make my beats, and you know, I needed, I just needed an upgrade, honestly. Um, I wanted to actually build my own computer. It would have been cool. Uh, I think I would have been able to do it pretty easily, but I'd have to order all the parts, you know, since I, I do, I don't live, I don't live in my own house, obviously, I live in an apartment. I'd have to get all those parts, you know, they'd be ordered, and you know, I just have to, you know, it would just be a little hassle, you know, I just, I saw this laptop, and my brother also owns this laptop, saw the specs on it, and I was just like, holy shit, because, <laughs> uh, you know, the laptop I have, you know, I don't even show you, I mean, it looks, it, it was, it was a decent laptop, you know, for the time I had it, and you know, for what it is, and for, uh, what it was when I first bought it. I'll go through like the specs of this one and then I'll compare it to this one just so you know how much of a difference I'm going to be seeing. What this laptop had, I believe it had an i3, yeah, but a core i3 processor, uh, ran Windows 7, um, four gigs of RAM, you know, it's pretty much your just your basic computer, your basic laptop, so you know, it wasn't like built for gaming or anything like this baby is. All right, so this is what the laptop looks like when you uh, take the cloth off and everything else. Um, it's got a really nice finish to it. Uh, I really like this design they used for the outer part of the laptop. And this is what it looks like when you open it up. Uh, it's got the nice finish on the inside as well. Uh, the little logo for ROG. To get into some of the specs, uh, it does have the um, the Intel Core sticker on it. It's got the Core i7 7th generation. Uh, I believe that's the most uh, up-to-date um, processor out there. Um, it has the NVIDIA GeForce 1050 graphics card with uh, 4 gigs dedicated to the graphics card. Sorry, I'm kind of like going off these specs um, just off memory, so if, uh, if I get something wrong, I'll, I'll correct it or, you know, I'll put the uh, the link to the actual, like, what I bought on Amazon, I'll put that in the description so you can take a look at all the specs and everything on it, but after the uh, the 1050 graphics card, it has 16 gigs of RAM, I believe, I don't know how many USB ports it has, it has one there, and it has two on this side, I believe these two are 3.0s and this one is 2.0, it's got, you know, decent amount of USB, HDMI plug, obviously, uh, audio jack, um, I'm not sure if that's both headphone and mic, but I'm assuming that is so. Uh, but yeah, this this is a really nice looking laptop. So yeah, we're gonna get into the other components that come in the, uh, the box. Obviously the uh, charger, here's your one piece to your charger. It's got the uh, warranties, I believe, and the manual. I don't know if those are the manual. And then lastly, we have the last piece to the uh, charger. Um, I don't believe there's anything else in the box. Um, uh, I'll actually, I'll probably keep this um, just in case I, I take it anywhere. It's got a, it's got a handle on it. So yeah, you could actually take this anywhere you wanted to. Um, like I said, I, I am really excited for this because I haven't had a new laptop in about four, five, six years. So yeah, I'm, I'm actually really excited to get this thing up and running. So uh, let's do it. Alrighty, so I was able to get through the rest of the, uh, the prompts. Um, it's all pretty much self-explanatory. Uh, at the end, you um, free stuff that comes with it. Uh, I'm not sure what it is. It's like an Asus membership, or you get McAfee membership for free, or whatever. So yeah, I would just I would go ahead and do those things. You know, sign up for that, or you know, it'll ask you to put your in your email and whatever. So I would just say go ahead and do that. Uh, it's free, so you know, it can't really hurt you. But um, yeah, we're just getting ready to. Uh, load up here so once this is done uh, we should be rolling all right guys so we finally are on the desktop in about two days since i uh recorded the unboxing um i kind of just wanted to get everything set up before i showed you anything um particular with the uh computer itself um there is a couple things you're probably going to want to do once you actually load your computer up first thing you'll see i mean you'll see like you know the regular desktop um it's not going to have all this stuff obviously uh just your your basic windows 10 stuff so um what i would recommend doing definitely is um as soon as you log in i would go to the device manager 
and just make sure everything is up to date. So I would say definitely check your uh, your NVIDIA. I believe there's actually a app for that itself. I believe this will actually this will actually pop up when you first load your computer, and I believe there will be an update. So you're definitely gonna want to update your uh, your graphics card drivers. See, I have this driver already. Um, I think this is a new version, so yeah, we'll definitely we'll definitely download that. There's also a backlit keyboard for this. It's actually really cool. Um, I'm gonna go in here and search. You can just type in ROG, and the OR core will come up. And this here, you'll be able to change um, not everything, but a decent amount of settings. Uh, you can change the brightness of it, um, effects. You can have it at static, breath, or color cycle. I have mine on color cycle, which is just you know just cycles through all the possible colors that it has, or the range of colors that it has. You know, your reds, blues, greens. But yeah, I like to have the color cycle on with the slow tempo. Um, so that's just me. But yeah, so if you guys wanted to change that, that's the uh, that's where you go to change it. Yeah, definitely, uh, you're definitely gonna want to check and make sure everything in here is updated. And um, this also has a really cool um, sound manager here, where you can like change settings for your microphone or for your speakers. Um, speaker configuration here, uh, stereo obviously. I'm not sure what this is. There's actually sound effects. I have the shooting sound effect on. It sounds. Uh, the best in my opinion and uh, they actually have really cool sound effects uh, I'm not really sure if this is actually gonna change my voice and it probably will uh, it makes it so you're like talking in an auditorium um, you know just so you know you got you got all these really cool settings uh, it's just you know cool to be able to customize all this stuff being able to customize things like this is pretty cool uh, you know you could change your equalizer settings here um, so you know you know that's a really cool feature that they have on this you know be able to customize pretty much everything you want honestly uh, you know the keyboard you know the sounds and you know everything else you know gadgets um so you know customized options are what i like you know i like being able to make everything what i want so i'll kind of give you guys a little example of some gameplay you know i'm not going to play a very heavy intensive game uh, i'm just going to play you know slenderman game uh, but i'm going to run it on the ultra settings i'm also going to run it in windowed so you can see the uh you know the usage of this while you're playing a game and recording at the same time so uh, we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll run this. Um, alrighty, so yeah, just you know, pay attention to this a little bit while I'm playing. I'll just pick a random thing here. I beat Seventh Street before. I actually think there's a video on it. It's probably private, but um, we'll play Elementary. Elementary is a pretty good one. But yeah, um, this is just gonna be a quick example. I'll let this load in quick. So I was able to skip that. Alrighty, so we're in the game. Uh, it actually feels really nice, actually, to be uh, playing something at actual good graphics and not have it lag. But uh, yeah, this actually feels really nice. Uh, I know it's just you know like a small game, but even though like I've never been able to run any game on ultra settings, so you know just being able to play something in ultra and have it run smooth, it's a really good feeling. So uh, so yeah, we'll we'll play a little bit of this. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to be. I'll try not to make it too long. But, uh, but yeah, this is kind of like what gameplays would be like with me. Um, I like talking. Uh, I'll talk about anything, to be honest. But, uh, yeah, if you guys want to see me play some games, you know, let me know. Let me know in the comments. I'm not really much of a PC gamer. Um, I've obviously played a couple of PC games. Uh, I think I have Gary's Mod, you know, Five Nights at Freddy's, Slenderman, you know, just all your basic games. But, uh, you know, I could definitely get some, you know, different games like GTA or Titanfall uh, and see how those work on here. So, you know, if you guys want to see something like that, you know, let me know and I'll show you what this uh, computer can do. Uh, it's an uh, arm. Nice. All right, so we'll get into this gameplay. Uh, enough of the computer. We'll actually start playing here. Kind of scary, to be honest. Yeah, definitely keep an eye on the, uh, the RAM and the CPU usage here. Uh, you'll see pretty much what this computer can handle. We got another teddy bear here. We've got three already. All right, kind of scared. There's another one. Imagine if I beat this first try. Oh no, there's so many rooms. There's another bear. 
Give me. There's no way. How do I already have five bears? There's no way. I'm so scared. I've never actually beaten this one. There's a nice head there. Oh no. Don't go out on me. Oh! No! There's a dead body! Oh wait, this is the dead end! Shit! Oh fuck. There's a bear here. Nope. Don't even think about it. Come here. I'm so scared. I have six. Where, where would the other two be? Oh fuck. Oh fuck me. Fuck off, mate. How did I get myself in this mess? Alright, fuck it. Where are you? Ah! Fuck off, mate. I'm trying to have a good time. Let's see if we can lure him away somehow. Oh no! Through the wall. Alright, so that was pretty fun. I almost beat it actually, which is pretty insane. But uh, yeah, um, that's pretty much a little example of the graphics. Um, this game ran really well on Ultra, obviously. Yeah, I would definitely recommend if you have this computer, uh, test other games. You know, see how good they do. Um, you know, this computer, um, I would definitely recommend this computer. Uh, just to give it a little review. Um, I would definitely give this a 4 or 5 star. I haven't had any issues with it, so I would probably give it a 5 star. But, um, yeah, there's some reviews in there. I don't know why it's... I'm pretty sure it's rated at, like, a 3.6 or 3.8. But, um, you know, for the performance and for the price, uh, I would I would definitely recommend this computer. Uh, especially if, you, if you're like me and you haven't really upgraded in a long time. Um, you know, just seeing the, like, the price of this and, you know, the specs and everything and just... For a thousand bucks, uh, I really don't think you could get any better specs than this, you know, even building your own computer. Because um, that, that's what I was going to do, like I said, you know, I was going to build my own computer, and, you know, that would have been pretty cool. But, you know, just seeing um, how much this was, and, you know, it was on sale and everything. My brother also owns this laptop, so, you know, we've got we've got the same laptop, but, you know, he feels the same way uh, about, the, uh, about the laptop as well. Um, it runs really well. Other than that, uh, I don't really think there's anything else to go through. Um, you can kind of tweak everything else the way you like it, um, you know, with the keyboard and all the settings, but, um, definitely update everything before you get started, you know, before you get started playing games and everything and downloading a whole bunch of shit. Um, just, you know, make sure everything's up to date. Also, if you'd like to get any of these gadgets, um, I really like these actually. Uh, it tells you everything pretty much about what's going on with your computer. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description for the download for these. If you guys enjoyed the video, and if anything helped you, you know, leave a like. Um, if you have any concerns or comments or uh, any questions, um, definitely throw them down in the comments. You know, I'll do the best I can to uh, help you. Um, and like I said, uh, if you guys want to see any more videos like this, let me know. Uh, I'll definitely make tutorial videos if you guys want to see them. Uh, gaming videos, obviously. I also wanted to thank you guys so much for over 1,000 subscribers and um, all the support I've been getting recently. Uh, it's been pretty insane, actually. Um, so I, I really can't thank you guys enough for all the support and, you know, liking, commenting, um, just watching my videos. You know, I really appreciate you guys sticking around. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely back. I'm going to be uploading more videos, so stay tuned for that. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.